check in that second. Hi guys, how's it going? Mark here. So I got a question about dieting and how to start a diet really. It's a pretty simple question, just gotta nail down a few things really. Um, the first thing you want to do is calculate your maintenance calories, your daily caloric intake really. Um, to do this, I've actually made a video about it, but just to summarize it, it's um, you want to download something like MyFitnessPal or some sort of tool for measuring your calories. And you want to do that, you want to track your calories for five days in a row. Between, well, you could go more than five, five is minimum really. Um, so after, after you have that, you want to add up all your calories. It'll be different every day, most people's are. But um, you add them up and you add up the five days, divide by five to get your average for one day. So, um, Let's just say that works out about 2,500 calories, okay? Next thing you want to do is weigh yourself. So say you're weighing about 200 pounds. Um, you have you have your weight there. So you're going to divide up your calories, 2,500, into your macros, right? So that's your protein, your carbs, and your fats. So for protein, um, which is most important really for most people that are into training, it's um, you want to have about 1 gram of protein for every pound of body fat. So 200 pounds, 200 grams of protein, okay? So each gram of protein has 4 calories, so 200 grams of protein is 800 calories. So we take that away from your, your 2,500, what well you left with, 1,700. Um, next up is fats, right? So to calculate your fats, you want about half a gram of fat for every pound of body weight. So if you're 200 pounds, that's 100 grams of fat. And each gram of fat has 9 calories, so 900 calories altogether. Take that away from your 1,700 left with 800 okay so the 800 calories are going to be your carbs um, <clears throat> so each gram of carbs has 4 calories so divide 800 by 4 you get 200 grams of carbs so there you have your macros okay 200 protein 100 fat and 200 carbs um, but that's for your maintenance okay so next thing you want to do is drop your maintenance by about 200 and um, calories that's about 50 grams of carbs okay you re you're always going to take from carbs when you're starting out you don't really touch fat until the carbs start getting really really low um yeah um because protein and fat is essentially you want to keep them as high as possible for as long as possible really you almost never really drop your proteins um sometimes drop your fats when you start getting lighter on that but you don't want to drop them below 60 grams ever really and um, then you just start getting into health issues you know your libido will drop you have mood swings all kinds of crazy stuff you don't want and um, so it's always just hit the carbs I know carbs usually taste nicest with people really hate giving them up but it just has to be done when you're trying to diet or cut or lose weight whatever you want to do um, yes yeah, so I think I've covered everything there already if anybody has any other questions you can just comment below if you liked the video please like it, please subscribe if you want some more videos. Um and yeah, as I said, just comment below with any questions and I'll try and get back to you. Um Rolling stones of the rap game, not bragging, look bigger than jagging, not sagging.